Welcome to Live Chat Back. It's great to have you here again today, the home of So TV. And before we get on today's question, I gotta say, how hot do these guys look in these shirts, hey? Absolutely, oh, pretty good. Pretty good. Jimmy yeah, lovely, Stewart they? shirts, yeah. aren't yeah. they great? Yeah, I just this one in particular, I absolutely yeah. love. Yeah. Such a cool shirt. Yeah, yeah. it's Brilliant. good colour yeah. on you, actually. Uh, yeah, thanks. I love yeah. mine. I just, I, I can't get over it. Hmm. Yeah, they're just outstanding. Yeah. You actually got stopped the other day, didn't you? And yeah, asked where, yeah. Where... We uh, it's really funny because last last week when we was doing some filming, um, we bought our shirts. Uh, we did film and I was carrying them down to to, um, to my car and this uh, white BMW pulled up and, and this window uh, came down and there's a guy in there and he said, hey mate, where'd you get your shirts from? I absolutely love your shirts. So uh, that, that was quite... Yeah, absolutely. Literally, I just had them in my arm carrying them down to, down to the car. It's yeah, quite funny. Amazing. Brilliant. Because yeah, yeah. you look so great, that's what it is. So if you're sitting there drooling over these shirts, jimmystewart.com for you. So our question today is from Sinead in Ireland. And Sinead says, guys, do I really need technology in my salon? And secondly, people tell me that I need to go and learn more about technology, go to classes, etc. She said, it all sounds like a big investment to me. Is it really worthwhile? What well, think? I think, um, you know, it's apt. if you don't go down this route, you're just going to be left behind like you wouldn't believe. Everything now is revolves around technology. And like it or hate it, uh, you've just got to go with it. Look at the hairdressing world. You know, you've got things like, you know, um, places that you can go online to learn new haircuts. You've got iPads that you can use in the salon for consultations. I, for one, don't buy hair magazines anymore because I don't need mm. to because I've got Google Images. Mm. You know, you just type in there what you want to see. And because of the way Google works, that will give you the most up-to-date, relevant information. So, you know, even that small area is... It, you've got to embrace technology, the marketing of your business, you know, websites, all those sort of things. It's absolutely critical that you start understanding the way technology can work for your business. Yeah, absolutely. And that actually makes me think about the one of the first magazines that we had. We interviewed Vivian McKinder. And Vivian is teaching people online in real time. So she's literally on one side of the world if mm. you like from us anyway yeah. and the person wherever they are are seeing her live and she is training either Vivian or her team of course and that is where it is all going it's just so exciting though mm. it really is and I, I don't think it's really that scary it's just taking it one step at a time and and looking at what you want to use first and foremost and then just going from there yeah. um, and look at us at, at So Magazine you know our, our magazine is digital and it is interactive and therefore it's online and it can be viewed on a smartphone or a tablet uh, or of course a computer so so you can view that wherever you are, but the thing is it's got video, so you're flipping the page and they swish, even make the noise, I actually really like that, that appeals to the hairdresser in me, and you push play on the video and it's within the magazine. Yeah. So like Steve was saying, you know, magazine in print, while we, okay, we still, you know, like to have that sometimes, you're going to miss out on a lot of information if you don't learn how to keep up, basically. Hmm. I think it's important to remember that Technology is an evolution, it's not a revolution. Uh, yeah. We're progressing from pen and paper, magazines into tablets, mm -hmm. um, smartphones and things like that. Uh, you, you have clients come into the salon, they request what they saw on TV, which is technology. Mm -hmm. um, you can go straight onto Google Images, you can find exactly the image and the style they were looking for and consult them around that. You have apps designed for it. If you're a booth renter, you can just about run your business on a smartphone. There's no need to miss Amazing. appointments. You can do a reminder. You can. Mm. There's just so many things you can do out there with technology, and it is. It's an evolving of everything into a digital age. Mm. It's and, and it's vital, you know. It's and it's not expensive. Um, I was reading an article the other day that a Cray supercomputer, which came out in the 70s, which was like the ultimate computer for um, doing oil exploration and things like that, cost millions of dollars. Our smartphone now has ten times that processing power. Wow, oh, that's amazing! <laughs> yeah, right, really. And we can get it for like four hundred bucks. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, So you know, that's we've gone from millions of dollars to ten yeah. times more powerful yeah. for pennies. Yeah, that, that's a great point about yeah. the evolution. It's it is yeah. continually yeah. evolving. 
Yeah, no, I, I think um, I agree with everybody here too, Sinead. I think, um, and, and I think, you know, it's interesting that you're actually, you've actually been able to contact us and ask us that question because of technology. You know, it wouldn't have been that long ago that, you know, you're in Ireland, we're around the other side of the world, that we actually wouldn't have been able to connect as quickly and, and as effectively as that. So, so yeah, so I think technology is, is absolutely vitally important in your life, in your salon business. You know, your salon business... Um, using technology is just it will just be so much better and, and we were talking about it before the numbers for instance knowing the numbers of your business is the the key to being able to grow it you know you can't like they say you you, you can't um, manage what you can't measure with with technology you can yeah. measure absolutely everything in your business so that means yeah. you can manage it so much more effectively mm. so yeah technology mm. you know you keep up with it or just get left behind yeah yeah so yeah. true Mm. All those numbers, you know, that we can measure every day, such as average client visit rate and average client oh. bill and yeah. uh, retail and rebooking at the push of a button. Mm. And, I mean, how amazing is that? And look, oh. as coaches, I'm sure I can speak for all of us, that we wouldn't be able to get the high level of results that we do get from our salons if they weren't on computer. It no. makes mm. a big difference, right. you Because know? mm. we can measure not only where they are when they start, but where we take them to, which yeah. is awesome. Absolutely. So I hope that helps Sinead, and I'm sure you've got your pen out scribbling a whole lot of notes there on some ideas, especially those iPads. What do you reckon, hey? Good idea? Fantastic. Have a great week, everyone, and we'll see you again, same place, next bye -bye. week. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.